their message is peace and coming together in the country. What's your message? <laughs> you don't believe that for one minute, do you? That their message is? Yeah. That's what they said to me. Okay. Yeah, I believe them. Any protests the over the deaths of these cops today in Baton Rouge? I don't know. Any riots or protests over the uh, uh, police officers in Dallas, Texas? What's happening to this world? What are you asking? It's a pretty Won't simple question. I asked you if what's your message to the people, their message is one of peace. What is your message? My message has been clear from day one, two years ago. This anti-cop sentiment from this hateful ideology called Black Lives Matter has fueled this rage against the American police officer. Have a conversation about the black on black crime, which kills more black males, which is more of a threat to any black male in the United States than a, than a, than a law enforcement officer. Sure. Yes, that's a, whole, that's a different conversation. We can walk and chew gum at the same time. There is an issue when it comes to violence. Black on black crime, or black, it's, it's crime. White people kill white people, tend to kill oh, white yeah. people. You know, black people tend not to kill black people. Not, not in the numbers. Not in the numbers. That's fine, but that's a different I don't care who white people are That is a different killing. conversation than police brutality. And we're not having that conversation right now. Involvement in violent crime, and crime in general, but violent crime, you're gonna see that black males are overrepresented. Yeah. Overrepresented in terms of being involved in violent crime. That's going to mean sure. more arrests. That's going to mean more people going to prison. This stuff has already been the bomb. Sure. That's a different conversation. Blue Lives Matter in America.